Oh, hey. <laughs> All right, welcome to lesson three of working with the AV Foundation framework to interact with your camera device to show you a preview of what your camera is currently seeing. And then in this lesson, I'm going to actually show you how to grab it's a still image, grab that picture, and display it here in your NS image view. All right, so let's go ahead and close this out. All right, we have all our uh, methods, action methods, uh, everything's set up. We obviously know the preview works. All right, so it's beautiful, everything's condensed. All right, so here we're gonna use the same method, all right? We declared two things here already. It's the AV Capture Connection, Video Connection, and the AV Capture Still Image Output. Um, and these are the two that we're gonna be working with now. We're gonna do part of it here in the Setup Preview Layer method. All right, so go ahead and use your still image output variable equals AV capture still image output. You're going to allocate and then initialize. All right, next thing you need to add the uh, output settings and you're implementing the NS dictionary class. NS dictionary, call this output settings equals NS dictionary and allocate then initialize with objects and keys and then you're going to be using the AV video codec uh, JPEG and then the AV video codec key obviously since we're using uh -oh, a key all right and again since we're using the um, a dictionary the last value needs to be nil okay so moving forward, all right, we need to add these settings to the to the instance of the still image output. Output settings. All right. Now that we have that, we need to add um, this output to our session device. And again, you can just check to make sure uh, if your session can add it. Add output uh, out still image output uh, session add output still image output. All right, and again, you can do an else block and check. All right, so moving forward, this is the part that we're going to do in the setup preview layer. The next part we're just going to do right here in our take picture layer, and we'll be using the um, AV capture uh, connection, which we named video connection. And we're going to put that to nil. All right, so we're going to say for AV capture connection, we're going to get the connections from the still image output um, instance. Name this one connection or just connection in, still, image, output, connections. All right, then also we're gonna loop through and get, we're gonna say the AV capture um, input port, we're gonna call this, uh -oh, call this port in, we're gonna say connection input ports. All right, so here you're gonna you're gonna check to see whether or not um, the current port has, is the of media type video. So you're gonna say if um, port media type um, is equal, and then AV media. Golly, I cannot type video, and then if it is, let's go ahead and. We'll do the brackets for this one. If it is, we're going to say that um, our video connection will equal the current one that we just checked, and we're going to break out of that loop. All right. Then also down here, we're just going to. This is a block that we're going to use just to break out of the entire loop that we're using right here, the first loop. If video connection, make sure that it doesn't equal nil, then break. All right, so now that we're out of there, next thing that we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and start getting the capture. So we're going to say still image output capture, and this is a long one. Um, you can try to type it. I try every time, but I always uh, just do it horrendously. 
display from connection and you'll use your video connection all right then also the completion handler will auto fill for you and I and I suggest that you try to give it a try oh yeah I'm not gonna type it okay so now that it has it highlighted just double click it the only thing that you need to put here is the semicolon and then you'll put your code here what this is gonna pass is just gonna be the image data sample buffer okay and what you need to do with that is just make sure that it's not nil image data sample buffer it's not equal nil all right so we're gonna say and this is let's get the uh, NS data because we're actually gonna create an image so NS data we're gonna put image data equals um, then we're gonna go, going to put AV capture still image output and then we're going to say JPEG. This is a long one too. Still image and as data representation. And then we're going to use the instance pass to us here, the sample buffer reference image data sample buffer. All right. So now that we have that, make sure we don't have any errors. The only thing is saying that we're not using the image data instance. That's okay. So let's go ahead and create an NS image. Call this image and then and this image to allocate. Then now we're, now we're going to initialize with data that we've that we've created here. Image data. All right, we're almost there. All right, next thing that we need to do is we'll just take um, another thing that we declared here in the header file. And we we created a reference and a link to our NS image view. Yay! Okay, so all we need to do is self dot image view one and grab the image property and then just assign it to image all right so easy stuff guys basically what we did here is uh, we initialized the still image output um, instance uh, we added the output settings uh, JPEG and then we added the output to our session all right here in the take picture click so when we click the button um, it's going to uh, look for a connection port I uh, make sure that it's media type video we're going to break out of that loop or to come here and then um, basically what we're doing here is we're setting up our delegate so that way every time this is called this this code block right here is going to be called and that is what uh, this completion handler is for all right and then uh, check to make sure that the data sample buffer is not um, not nil I'll grab the image data created an image with the image data and then we sign that image to our NS image view all right, so let's go ahead and run it. Hope it works. All right. <laughs> okay. All right, man. All right, moving forward, moving forward. All right, actually, we never even tested the stop preview. Let's go ahead and stop it. All right, boom. Let's turn it back on. All right, still there. Now let's go ahead and try to take a picture. Hope this works, please. Boom. <laughs> All right. All right, I, I knew it was gonna work, but it's for um, for the video. All right. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. I hope this wasn't too lengthy. I can be long-winded. I ramble. I even mumble. So my apologies, and thank you for watching. See you later.